Convalescent plasma has been used for decades as a therapy for the prevention and treatment of infectious diseases, using the antibodies of recovered patients to help fight the virus in those who are infected. And now, thanks to the Trump administration's Operation Warp Speed, the FDA has now authorized the treatment for emergency use in those infected with COVID-19. Today, I'm pleased to make a truly historic announcement in our battle against the China virus that will save countless lives. More than 70,000 patients infected with the Chinese coronavirus have now been treated with convalescent plasma. And weekly donations have doubled in the week since late July when the administration partnered with commercial labs, insurers, and healthcare providers to encourage an increase in donations. FDA Commissioner Dr. Stephen Hahn applauded the president's early action to make this breakthrough possible. From the beginning of this pandemic, the president has asked FDA to cut back red tape to try to speed medical products into the hands of providers, patients, and American consumers. While America has the lowest COVID-19 fatality rate of any country in the world, for those who are infected with the virus, convalescent plasma has proven to be a safe and effective treatment that could save lives. The data we gathered suggests that patients who were treated early in their disease course, within three days of being diagnosed, with plasma containing high levels of antibodies, benefited the most from treatment. We dream in drug development of something like a 35% mortality reduction. This is a major advance. The administration urges those who have recovered from the coronavirus to sign up to donate their plasma at coronavirus.gov. Jen Pellegrino, One America News, the White House.